So we tried to reach out to Eastern University of Illinois and Milliken and their arts department. And that led to a connection with Scott Lindley from Mount Pulaski. He's a graduate of Eastern Illinois University, and he's part of a group called the Wall Dogs. They're a group that um, branched off probably 20, 22 years ago from a group called the Letterheads. Kind of jumped off of that, and then they started doing murals in communities. Um, the first community was in Iowa, and then they've done um, about one a year throughout the United States um, since then. What's your favorite part about it all? I think part of it was just the reliving the community's history. Um, you know, each night that they were here in Arcola, they they get a little further on the murals, and more people would come downtown and talk about the things that, that stuck out in their mind from, you know, like the candy shop or the uh, stories about Joe Ernst or, you know, the Raggedy Ann or from Corn Festival. It just, it brought back a lot of good feelings for the community from those things that, you know, may have happened 20, 30, 40, 50 years ago. I think it's awesome. I think anything art-wise, historical, mm -hmm. is high interest of mine. And I was in awe of how they collectively got together and how quickly they could do it. And I'm sure, like anything, there were some people that were negative. Mm -hmm. You know, um, the money was raised not in the city taxes, so you know, it was from donations and so forth, and the people here put them up. Something in the sideline that's kind of funny, if you look out, there's Candy Kitchen. Oh, um, yeah. Well, people think that that building is a candy kitchen that they can go in and buy candy. Oh, wow. Well, you know, so I, it's a newspaper office. I told them they should get suckers and some caramels. They could, you know, make some money. Yeah. And, but when I tell them no, it's it's not. And they just look at me like, well, the sign says, 